All right. So let's remove this and this. Let's leave these. And let's actually uh, let's see what we can do here. Okay, let's try like this. Let's try this configuration. But if it doesn't work, then we will uh, shuffle the spaceship a little bit. Let's see our Duna. Duna, where is the Duna? Um, this is the Duna. Set target. So it's gonna take quite a, quite a while until it will go there. So what we have to do, we have to leave the Duna uh, and we want to meet the Duna over here. So in that time, so the Duna has to be somewhere here for it to make this much to get there and for us to make this much to get there. It's not here, it's somewhere here. All right? So set up how we're leaving we're gonna leave over here somewhere and maneuver like so see if we can time this maneuver better. Is it getting bigger? I don't actually see. No, I'm guessing that's correct. Let's add some more power. So this is where we intersect some of the orbit over here. Mm, no, this was quite enough. All right. So if we would launch in two hours, we would arrive here, but the Duna was, would be still here. So it takes this much, it means Duna must be somewhere here, so it would arrive at the same time. So let's see, how much is our period right now? Where is my Kerbal engineer? Orbital data. So now our orbital period is 30 minutes 20, uh, 53.487.82. So let's type it here. Like this. We're gonna take uh, 100 days, I think. So 3,000 minutes and f 5, 3, 4, 8 seconds orbital period. What's going on? Well, Something's going on. Okay. Again. Three thousand minutes. 
five, three, four, seven seconds. That's a hundred days. Where is the tuna? Oh, that's it. That's too much, right? That's not a hundred days. Wait a minute. <coughs> the hell am I saying? It's a hundred orbits, not a hundred days. Ah, uh, Protracta says Prefella. <laughs> it shows prediction angles. Prediction angles. What are you talking about? another zero here and here whoa that's too much <laughs> that is actually too much No, it doesn't work. Yeah, <laughs> Rafaela says you look like fortune teller right now. <laughs> I like it. Oh Jesus Christ! No, that's too much. I look like a fucking fortune teller. Okay. 
So let me understand, right? First of all, delete this node. So let me understand. We are going faster than Duna. So Duna will be here, and we would go around half of our orbit. When it goes quarter orbit, we go half our orbit. So Duna would be here when we are here. Now Duna would be here when we are here again. So around here, we have to be over here. And the Duna will be somewhere here. So we actually have to wait the whole damn year. I think that's what we have to do. Uh, to wait a damn year. So let's make a node. Like this. And wait one year. Boop. And here's the note. We still have to leave in a prograde like a big boys. So we're gonna do like this. Or something damn similar. So, oh, damn it. it's not quite a prograde. Let's fix it a little bit like this. Uh, maybe too much. Yeah, something like that. Are we hitting some? Oh my god, we hit him the damn moon. Damn you, moon. Go away, okay? Go away. It went away. So if it will be a year, <laughs> I'm a fortune teller. But uh, my fortune tells me that if it will be a year, our intersection with uh, Duna will be damn close. See? So my fortune is uh, not so bad after all. And that means... Uh, I have to wait. Wait a minute. This is the target position. So, do not pass by then. So let's make minus um, zero point two of a year. Is that possible? No, I don't. I don't need to use minus. Delete. Okay. Yeah, that's possible. So let's point uh, our prograde again. Like this. Or something similar. And now my fortune tells me that I'm not going to proper prograde because I'm wasting a lot of fuel and actually I need to reduce some more years let's reduce some more years two forty six for Duna says Profella Duna must be in front of Kerbin on orbit yeah I know it must be in front we already established that. But how much... How many hours it is from now? That's what we need, really. Well, that's a very bad timing for burn. That's a good timing for burn, I think. Yeah, that's perfect timing now. That's gonna be too much burn, right? No. It's not enough burn? What do you mean it's not enough burn? That's a lot of goddamn burn. Am I doing something wrong here? Let's, that's 1200 burn. That should be plenty. Uh, 
100 seconds. So this is our position, and that's the position of Duna. And this is 170 days. That's where we burn from here. How many, how many days in uh, Kerbin's year? Okay, that's my question. How many days in Kerbin's year? Do you know? Is it possible to find out? So this mission is going on for 150 days already, huh? Fella says, let's fly by trajectory. I don't know what is trajectory, but uh, I don't know what is that. <laughs> there is no but. I mean, there is but. It's sitting here on the chair. But it's not gonna fly anywhere on uh, trajectory. take a lot of time <laughs> what happened here why the sudden change anyway another 50 days plus let's see where we are in 50 days So, okay, let's do like this, uh, let's not screw around, make a note here, 25 minutes from now, leave in the Kerbal system, like this, left the system, what we can see, we can see our intersection of Duna orbit, but we don't need it. So we reduce over here, like so. So we barely exit the system, right? Here, we barely exit the system. Now we make another burn around the around here, and it will take us. The other side. Oh, wait a minute. What we have to do is not to take this burn. We make a, a note here. Now we match the planes with a target over here. Before this, and we set up as a closest and create a note. So it will create a um, note here that will match the plane. Now we set up the burn, the regular burn over here, and this burn will take us somewhere. Intersection. So this intersection is here. What we do, we do like this. I'm getting 
We're getting a little bit closer. Come on. Let's reduce this one. Over here. Yeah, and uh, it's going to be somewhere there. Somewhere there. It's not ideal, right? But that's something. That's one way to eyeball it. Okay, right, science has been done. Look, there is intersection with gender. Okay, that's fine. This will take one year. 194 days to accomplish. Uh, doesn't seem right to me. Say whatever. That's not right. So what they says. Check it out. What they says that this maneuver over here will be 222 days from uh, now. And then this maneuver over here will be how many? 232 days. And then I have to wait the whole year almost. So it will come to one year, uh, 194 days. Professor says, uh, nine, <laughs> what? <laughs> nine million, 203 seconds. Half trajectory is acceleration and another half is braking. Okay. Brachistor Okay. Got it. But anyway, we're not gonna do it. Let's see. Okay. Let's go back from this one to our initial ejection, right? So here, for example, let's let's make an example, right? We burn as much as possible to intersect some dunery. Here we have the sending node, so we're gonna put maneuver over here and then match plane with targets with the nearest maneuver over here. So it will match the planes over here. Now, over here, we will add maneuver. Um, no, actually, we have to wait half, an, half a year and add maneuver over here this is t, t minus, minus 14 days that's not what I'm looking for I'm looking for waiting a year so somewhere like this we're gonna make a maneuver right no mistake yes one year 30, uh, 130 something days and over here What kind of maneuver can we make? Yeah, you know what? I think the the best solution is actually the smallest orbit or we can actually decrease our orbit and increase it later we have 3000 delta v we can we could do that if we slow ourselves down like this Delay 
Okay, if we slow ourselves down until we exit, right? This maneuver 13 days, okay, add maneuver, and then match the planes, yeah, and then <coughs> Profella says, oh no, slowing is wrong decision. I don't think so. I think it's right decision. Prove me wrong. We do this. Slow slow in his wrong decision, right? Slow in his very wrong decision. So let's go here and do like this. Okay, let's reduce this. It's a thousand. Yeah. I guess slow and is wrong decision. And they will be intercept. So let's see how much it will cost me. Yeah, something like this. something here I saw it okay so let's see final verdict is hmm slowing down is the right decision after all slowing down will bring the final maneuver down to 348 days which is less than a year which is what we actually want we want to have less than a year and not more than a year so slowing down is a good decision in terms of time but in terms of delta v you can see this maneuver is zero delta v of course this one is seven that's nothing this maneuver is a thousand six hundred and the exit maneuver is another thousand right exit maneuver how much ah, exit maneuver is another thousand so the total delta v for transfer to duna is uh, 2600 that's a lot of uh, that's a lot of goddamn delta v and i don't think i i care too much about time 
to allow this kind of uh, thing to happen. Let's reduce, let's do this, let's remove this one, remove this one, and remove this one. Let's reverse again, and let's remove the node, oh god damn it, there, let's reverse it again. Let's put the note over here. Gonna hit the moon. something like this. <clears throat> now let's see if we can first of all Then put over here, then create a node. Okay. So what can be done? All right, so how much is this? Um, it says something strange. Okay, 559 days, and it's same delta V actually. It's same delta V if uh, we would go uh, opposite direction. <laughs> okay, so let's screw this. Let's screw this one as well. And screw this one. Put the node, empty node over here. Then create a match. And then create Hoffman. Hoffman will be here. The Hoffman will be in three years. <laughs> what the hell? 
It's a three years transfer. Oh my god. Go home. Why would I want a three years transfer? No. I disagree. That's a one year maneuver. It's a year from now. It's a year as well. Okay. Let's set up maneuver here. This maneuver, 220 days. Now, match the planes, nearest hand, create node, over here, and now the Hoffman. Well, where's the goddamn note? Oh, there it is. One year, 90 days. Yeah, it all goes down to one year, 90 days in the end. Delta V required for this maneuver is 900 and the first time Delta V required is 900 so overall is something 1900 Prefella says you can f try a little bit overshoot at first maneuver it can help resonant orbit quickly. Yeah, I tried that. Didn't you see before? I tried that. It uh, turns out it will be uh, like the uh, same amount of delta V as before. It takes uh, a second maneuver is 1600 delta V. I mean, I have the delta V. It's fine. It saves some time. I can uh, make overshoot orbit and uh, wait for Duna to catch up this way or I can go faster and catch up with Duna myself if I catch up with Duna myself I win a lot of time but uh, I spent uh, how many 700 Delta V more I guess it's it's possible to do. It's not that bad. What do you think I should do? Should I do this maneuver? I mean, this maneuver is for sure will take me. Will take me places. So total of this maneuver is 
Perfella says, maybe you want to use some gravity assist. <laughs> How did you know? How did you know? No, it's the wrong direction. I need the opposite direction. So the exit trajectory is here. That's not a good trajectory to exit. So how do we fine tune it so it will be a good trajectory to exit? Flight to Duna will be something something, <laughs> says for a fella. <laughs> it is already something something, man. It is already something something. Okay, so I think. I think this way the angle is different, right? So if I put it like this, but then I increase this one, the angle is a little bit different, right? Is it good different or bad different? It's more of a don't care different. It's gonna be something, something. Huh? Well, it's not gonna even be enough. 
enough here. Oh, that's a different angle. Let's see what's going on here. Can you get me closer? How uh, how tall is the um, how tall is the atmosphere of uh, Eve? No, it doesn't help me a lot. What I want is I want to make angle so I exit this way. If I exit this way, then I win. But I, I cannot text it that way. So let's make it as mean, as much as possible again. No, not this way. So let's go all the way here. Let's increase this one over here. Let's go all the way here. And increase this one again. I don't know, is it getting closer? I, I think it's getting closer. I think ultimately what I'm doing is just increasing the, our encounter here and I don't think that's what I want to do also increasing the maneuver here ok let's reduce this maneuver let's create another maneuver Match planes with the target, yeah. This one here. <clears throat> Profella says, Don't forget about EVE atmosphere, it's 90 km or above. Alright. So let's, let's say our approach is this, right? So this is our approach here. So what we're gonna do is uh, fine tune it a little bit more. No, 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 no! Uh, I'm doing the wrong thing. Um, this note. Fine tune it so we get an encounter over here like this, and at the same time over here we'll make a note. It's not a good. It's not a good maneuver. No, I disagree. The best maneuver is when we perform maneuver at uh, full speed. Over here, if we could do something in this direction, but we don't approach. If from the correct direction to do, to do this slingshot, so let's reduce a little bit here. No, that's too much. Slingshot time. If we are to increase our speed, what changes are we looking at? So, this is our entry, this is our exit. Let's increase our speed some more. Let's 
So how much Delta V would we need to reach Duna, this slingshot? Send Duna as target. Much planes. Also wouldn't intercept Duna. It would be too far. Well, of course it would be too far still. But how much is this thing shot? I think it's too much. Eighteen hundred. Why I want the slingshot? No, I don't want slingshot. Forget about slingshot. Okay, no slingshots. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're not gonna fly by Eve. It's a it's a ridiculous idea. I was entertaining just for fun. I'm gonna fly by Eve. What? We're gonna fly by. <laughs> We're gonna fly by Moho and make a slingshot from that. No, that's ridiculous. But the original idea was we're slowing down here, and because we're slowing down, we're going faster. We can actually make a something out of this. So if we make something out of here, like this, right? We could actually catch this is what? Targeted closest approach. Anyway, we want to burn from here to no to here and create node over here. This is separation, but if we find this node, where is it? This one is a thousand node, right? And we do like this. That's actually <laughs> Ridiculous. Professor says, your drilling mission became some challenge. <laughs> yeah. Drilling, yeah, drilling is a lot of challenge. Let's set the maneuver over here. And then much plane. And there you go. That's what we'll have. This position will be after two years and 214 days. Also, here is how much maneuver? 1500, well, 1600 here and another thousand in the beginning. Yeah. Let's not do this. Remove all nodes. Let's go to our carbon. Add maneuver. I'll 
god damn it. Let's escape first of all. Escaping. And after we did this, first of all, this one? No, this is one year. I'd money over here and match the planes and Hoffman transfer. Yeah. So this is what the hot Hoffman transfer looks like, right? Over here and over here. How about first we set up the transfer? Uh, where is it? Like this. This is one year. 196 days, right? And that. What do you think? This Hoffman transfer will be 980. Uh, separation will be how many? Ah, 935. And it will take one year, 196 days, to intercept Duna. Perfella says, use minimum, no. Okay. Uh, 